Hello, thank you for joining us today. My name is Cheryl Norales and I'm the founder and president of Garrett American Heritage Foundation United here in California. We were invited today to come to the fiambre that the Guatemalan community does every single year. As you can see behind us, it's a great community that came out for us to enjoy fiambre. Fiambre is a traditional Guatemalan meal that is done around this time of year in uh, celebration of Day of the Dead. And there's a whole bunch of food, a whole bunch of cold cuts and everything like that. And we gather together as a community and we eat the food. Everything is donated. Everybody comes together, pitch in, you know, whatever they can, you know, to help build the great fiambre, the grand giant fiambre. Everything is donated, the food, the drinks and everything, the entertainment. So we have all different bands of together to showcase their culture with us and all of the performance are beautiful. It is like a very exciting time of the year for like the, the entire Mayan community and we're so happy that every year we're invited to take part and participate and share in their culture and to learn about their culture. And it's kind of like with Garifuna. Garifuna we also do something like this we put uh, we call it a put down we put food down for our ancestors but we do it at a smaller scale and oftentimes we do it behind closed doors but i've always thought that it would be so so great for us to actually open up our spiritual tradition of putting down for our ancestors and invite other indigenous groups to come with us and celebrate what we do and share with them what we do as we honor our ancestors. It's time for us to come from, you know, out of the closet, behind dark corners and just celebrate our, our spirituality freely. I mean, we should not be ashamed to worship our ancestors and to honor them. We need to take it out, bring it out to the community and do and showcase it, showcase it to the world like how they're really doing it here today. You know, there's, you know, nobody's hiding anything. We're just here celebrating in the open, sharing our traditions with everybody. Everybody is welcome here. You know, when we, when we come over here, you know, everybody's welcome. You have people who are from Guatemala, people who are not from Guatemala. You have all nationalities that are here, all races in celebration of this fiambre and in celebration of the beautiful Mayan culture. So again, I invite, you know, other indigenous groups to just come out of their, their shell and be proud of your traditions, be proud of all of your traditions, especially your spirituality. You know, come out, share with people and you know, just let people know what your traditions are. That's part of learning, that's part of sharing culture. It's to just celebrate everything, not just the dances and the music, but also to celebrate and share our spiritual beliefs and culture. So in the Garifuna culture, we do a lot of things in honor of our ancestors. We do a put down, which is putting down food for our ancestors, their favorite food to eat. We also um, give them a um, symbolic bath where we bathe them symbolically of course and we provide new clothing for them to honor them in their death. The thing with the Garifuna spirituality is that we have a covenant with our ancestors. They take care of us in the living if we, rem if we remind, remember them and we honor them and we take care of them in death, meaning that we honor them by remembering them, you know, we put down food for them, we honor them, we give them celebrations and we just make sure that we keep them close in our heart and in our minds. And as we do that, they take care of us here in this world by watching over us and protecting us. So that's the sacred covenant that we have in our, with our ancestors. And it's nothing that we should be ashamed of. It's part of our culture, it's part of our tradition. And, you know, we just have to bring it out more into the open, you know, and not be um, and so isolate, isolated and, you know, hiding our culture and hiding our, our spiritual tradition. Again, it shouldn't be about just dancing and partying when it comes to our Garifuna culture. We are beyond that. You know, there's more to us than just the, you know, the dancing and um, the punte and that you see on these videos and everything like that. We are a more, you know, solid people. We have a solid foundation and part of our foundation is our care from the spirituality. So again, you know, let's, you know, remember who we are as Garifuna, you know, the all-inclusiveness of who we are, our, our spirituality, you know, as part of our culture, and we have to be proud, you know, to honor those traditions and to, you know, celebrate them freely.
Louder, louder. Bueno, Alex, esto es Guatemala. A ver, podemos hacer un boom, una foto muy grande con todos los vestimentos de todos los diferentes. Se puede hacer uno con todos los vestimentos tradicionales y un algo que tengo, tengo en común de la comunidad de Puerto Rico con el de Guatemala. Puerto Rico obviamente es español y ahí son ciudadanos americanos que no hablan inglés y una gota de inglés y, pero así entendemos que la comunidad de Guatemala con los 22 idiomas bien recibido aquí en Los Ángeles y parte de la comunidad. A ver, 